Okay, so we are back with more alien isolation. Um, I died several times getting to this point. Molotov. Put the code in here. Two five zero five. Be quick, because Mr. Alien is about to pop out yes, somewhere. Yes. I'm on my way. There he is. There he is. There he is. I'm just gonna take a little stroll down here. I don't think there's anything in here, and it's a dead end, so it's probably not a good idea. And I made myself a Molotov just in case he gets close to me again. And I can throw fire in his face. Gone, Mr. Cuddles. Okay. He's got bored and left, which is very, very, very helpful for us. Um, I like how, as I was watching him then, sometimes when he goes around corners and stuff, it's, it's really, really well done the way his tail sort of hugs the corner and moves with the corner. Um, other times his tail seems to go, like, right through the corner, which is not really as attractive. He has dropped down. Hopefully he's gonna go get that guy that's over there. No, no, he's there. He's right there. Let's, let's not get help. Let's just run away. Far away over here. Go and sit in the waiting area and wait to die. Hmm. Oh, there they are. Oh, people. The freight's every side, so somebody can get away. If we see it, we just run. <gasps> wait. Take a look around, you're outnumbered. I know. We won't tell you again. You can get the We got covered in smoke. <laughs> There's an alien just gonna go and eat your face while I run away. Are you done? Mr. Cuddles, are they dead? I think he's done. Oh, look what happened to you. I guess that serves you right for pointing a gun in my face, doesn't it? What are you hiding over here getting all upset? Oh yeah? Oh yeah? Well look, my friend's over there, he's gonna kill you. I think he just chased after. Okay, so... <gasps> Here it is. <laughs> Look at the blood trail. There's a trail of blood leading away from this. As if something came out of her and ran away. Yep. She is the mommy. 
There's the mummy. <gasps> Samuels, I've got the medals. Medicine. We're at the transit station outside medical reception. Ripley, we heard gunshots. And if we heard them, so did the creature. Hey, Mr. Coddle, should come to say hello to your mommy? He's a... Hang on, I can't... He's a very beautiful boy you have. And so much fun. Right, okay. Now let's get you down to some skis for peace and this. I would like to see what's on his tail. Autopsy report. Catherine Foster, 39, female, crew member of the Anisadora, body identified by Marlowe Hapes, the Anisadora's captain. And it's all classified. Turner, we've had something go down here in San Cristobal. Tape off the scene and make sure it's not touched until Garcia comes in with forensics. Keep this quiet for now. I want total silence. Last thing this station needs is a panic. And one other thing. If I find out who leaked this to Ransom, I'll make them eat their fucking badge. He turned up, quoted seeks and privileges, and had a ringside seat for the whole goddamn mess. This is a serious incident. I don't need Ransom making it more complicated. Do you read me? Wait up. Mm. Looks like Ransom came and threw his weight around. Oh, yes, he did. I think now we need to leave, don't we? Access the reception. Okay, so it's over there. I'm acutely aware right now. I don't know how long my health has been that low. But I'm going to uh, put it up a little bit. So that we don't die instantly. Which way have I got to go? The reception. That way. Back the way I came. Behind me. All the way around. Oh, you died. He mangled you up good. That's my I thought that was someone standing up then, but it's not. It's that guy sitting down. Sitting down. Yeah, I have to go all the way around and just pick it up. Can I check you for goodies? I did, he has a flare. I don't need a flare. Okay. As my boy. What? It's not cruel to use the other humans as bait. They would shoot me in the face the moment they got a chance. 
They is not my friend. Look, he had revolver. He would have killed me dead. First chance he got. a molotov to survive now. see something really awesome. Die in a fire, Mr. Alien! <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Cuddle didn't, really did not deserve that. He didn't, he didn't. Look. Look at the floor. He's bleeding! <gasps> the floor is all on fire. I made him bleed. We made him bleed his own blood. And she's not going to be happy about it at all, but he kind of had me cornered in that room, so I had to do something. I don't feel guilty for making Mr. Cuddles bleed his own blood. I don't. I'm going back when I should be going forward. Or am I going forward when I should be going back? I don't know anymore. I'm all confused. feel guilt. If it makes you feel any better, Mr. Cuddles, I feel guilt. This way? Medical reception's a no-go. I can't get out. That's the only way through. Ripley, this is a public hospital. There has to be an evacuation procedure. Okay. Well, we'll try and do that. I still haven't built an EMP mine, which I, I really could do. So we have to set off the evacuation procedure, uh, which means going all the way back around there, of course. isn't going to be too close by. Okay, so the power plant we need to go into. Ambulance bay. More flares that I haven't used. He's got a flat. Okay, so I have to restore the power to this. Which simple enough. Not 
first I will know to use the save point. It tells me that there is hostels nearby. I know there is hostels nearby, I know where Mr. Puddles is at the moment. He's sitting just in that vent over there. You see? You see? You see his little spit? Yeah. He's just sitting over there. He's uh he's not actually gonna come out and play during this little part. He's just gonna sit there and chill and watch. If I didn't know any better, I think he was feeling a little bit sorry for himself for making his wounds. Because Mama hit him with a big board of fire and he ran away. Going to uh, equip this gun baton. And we're going to. Ripley, are you okay? Ripley! Not now! No, not right now. See, he, he has white eyes if you look at him. But if he sees me, he will be like, you shouldn't be here. So. If you find this facility in a state that isn't to your liking, please let me know. So I'm not going to give him the chance. I'm going to stab him in the butt. And then beat him with the wrench thing. Uh, what's this thing called again? Uh, yeah, this thing. I can't even remember what it's called now. But, uh, yeah. We're gonna beat him to death with it. Are you still over there, Mr. Cuddles? What you doing? Hmm. He's like, I watched how well she dispatched of him. I'm gonna go and look over here for her. Totally intimidated. Oh, totally intimidated. Maybe I should pay attention to what I'm doing here. There we go. have done this, still be very aware and very careful. Okay. Oh, no, this library is back there, he is waiting under that one, so we're gonna have to go around. He's waiting just there. Thinking he's gonna trick me, which he's not, because I'm onto his silly games. He's kind of hanging back, I think, a little bit at the moment. I think uh, the Molotov gave him a pause of thought. It's my theory, and I'm sticking to it. He's totally intimidated. Totally. Oh, 
<laughs> really? Really, Mr. Goddles? Really? This just the game we're playing, huh? by one of these vents at some point she's gonna not look up she's gonna walk past the vent and I'm gonna get her Today, Mr. Cuddles, not today. The fact that my health seems to be going down, so I know that the the smoke can affect your health. So I'm uh, just going to make sure that it's not getting too low. I hope Mr. Goodles didn't get too badly hurt. <laughs> okay, so San Cristobal Station. It's not San Cristobal Station. San Cristobal Medical Facility is all fucked up. <laughs> so we're gonna slowly back away into the elevator. And we're going to leave the scene of the crime. And with that, I'm going to finish this video. I will be back very, very soon with more alien isolation. So feel free to join me, why don't you?